Hi folks, how are you all? Hope you are all doing well. Now I am going to explain to you the theorem number 6.2 in the chapter triangles. So let me read it. If a line divides two sides of a triangle, if a line divides two sides of a triangle in the same ratio, the line is parallel to the third side. In the triangle ABC, there is a line DE. The line DE divides the triangle AD, AB and AC sides with the same ratio. That means AD by DB is equal to AE by AC. That is given. If that is so, this DE is parallel to BC. That has to be proved. Okay. Let us go for the proof. So, what, what to be proved? To be proved. So, we need to prove. What we need to prove? DE is parallel to BC. That is what we have to prove. Then what is given to us? What is given to us is uh, AD by DB is equal to AE by EC. That is given. If this is given, we have to prove that DE is parallel to BC. So, for this, we shall make an assumption. What do we assumption? Let us assume. Let us assume that DE is not parallel to BC. Let us assume that D is not parallel to BC. If D is not parallel to BC, there should be something that will be parallel to BC. D is not parallel to BC. That means there will be something else that will be parallel to BC. So, let us see. So, then let us say there is a line called from D we draw a D E dash d e dash that is parallel to b c. So, let us. So, d is not parallel to b c that means there is another line called d e dash that is parallel to b c. Understood? So, what we assumed that d is not parallel to b c. Now, we made an assumption that if D is not parallel to BC, there is another line that is parallel to BC that is DE dash. Suppose now DE dash is parallel to BC, then according to our BPT, what is our BPT? Basic proportionality theorem. As per our basic proportionality theorem, AD by db is equal to a e dash by e dash c b p t b p t did we get it so a d by db is equal to a e dash by e dash c by our b p t why how we are using BPT? If a line divides two sides of a triangle in the same ratio and that particular line will be parallel to BC that is our BPT. That is our BPT. What is our BPT? If a line divides, if a line is parallel to BC it will automatically divides AB and AC into proportion ratio that AD by DB is equal to AE by AC. So, here if D dash is parallel to BC then AD by DB is equal to AE dash by E dash C. But the given is AD by DB is equal to AE by EC. So, I can write now AE by AE by EC is equal to a e dash by e dash c ok 
can i write like that yes i can write like that because ad by db is equal to ae by ec that is given to us here we said by bpt ad by db is equal to ae dash by e dash c that means if you see these two that means ae by ec is equal to ae dash by e dash c i can write so ae dash by ec is equal to ae by ec is equal to ae dash by e dash i can write like that can i write like that yes i can write like that now let me add one to the both the sides let me add one to the both the sides ae by ec plus 1 ae dash ae dash by e dash c plus 1 can i write like that yes i can write like that so now let me let me uh, take an lcm here ec ae plus ec is equal to e dash c is equal to ae dash plus e dash c can i write like that yes so what is ae plus ec ae plus ec is equal to ac ac by ec is equal to what is ae dash plus e dash c ae dash plus e dash c that is also ac ac by e dash c observe this that means ac is equal to ac ec is equal to e dash c e c is equal to e dash c so is it possible a line starting from c c is equal to c e dash is it a possible it is not possible a line starting from here on the same line segment can it have a equal distance from the two points we cannot have if it the a to b is equal that's all there will not be another point which is equal distance like ab that's why ec is equal to e dash c that means e and e dash e dash should coincide coincide there that means e dash and e should be equal they are on the same place they are not on the same place that means our assumption that de dash exists is false our assumption is false our assumption a u s s as assumption our assumption was our assumption what did we assume false our assumption false what is our assumption that de is not parallel to bc that was our assumption that is wrong if de is parallel to bc not parallel to bc if that is wrong then what is right that de is parallel to bc d is parallel to bc hence finally what did we do de is parallel to bc hence proved hence proved what did we prove finally if a line divides any two sides of a triangle in the same ratio that line will be parallel to third side that means de is parallel to bc de is parallel to bc hence we proved this is the converse of the basic proportionality theorem listen to the video once again again and again you will understand it better bye bye